They like the vitality. They like the muscle growth. They like the fat loss. Um, it also can increase the amount of deep sleep that you get. I'll just be completely forthcoming. I've taken Sermorellin on and off for the last couple of years. I typically will take it anywhere from one to two nights per week. And I stopped taking it almost completely. I'll still take it every once in a great while. But the reason I stopped taking it is that I noticed that it made the sleep in the early part of my night very, very deep, very robust. But then I would wake up wide awake or I would sleep till morning. And then at least according to my eight sleep sleep tracker or my whoop sleep tracker, I wasn't getting nearly as much rapid eye movement sleep as I normally would. So at least in my case, and again, this is anecdata, it seemed to sort of replace rapid eye movement sleep with more deep sleep. And rapid eye movement sleep is critical for all sorts of things that deep sleep can't achieve and vice versa. So you really want both. So this is one reason why I've basically stopped taking Sermorellin. I'll occasionally take it every once in a while, but in general, I just you know stopped taking it because uh, whatever the positive effects might've been if I had taken it more consistently, the effects in depleting rapid eye movement sleep were just something I didn't want and don't want.